We're back now with developing stories from two states. Authorities in Pennsylvania and Oregon are both searching for escaped prisoners. Both are considered extremely dangerous. ABC's Alexis Christophorus reports. U.S. Marshals now joining dozens of law enforcement agencies in the search for this man, 34-year-old Danello Cavalcante, who police say escaped from Pennsylvania's Chester County Prison just before 9 o'clock Thursday morning, about 30 miles west of Philadelphia. Cavalcante, who is from Brazil, was set to be transferred to a more secure state facility in just four weeks after being sentenced to life in prison without parole for fatally stabbing his former girlfriend 38 times in front of her two young children. It's unclear exactly how Cavalcante managed to escape, but authorities say he is extremely dangerous. I think people need to be on high alert. This person is dangerous. He has killed someone. He is alleged to have killed another person. So people need to take every precaution possible. Lock your doors. He's also wanted for a 2017 murder in Brazil. Five feet tall and 120 pounds with curly black hair, Cavalcante was last seen wearing a white T-shirt, gray shorts, and white sneakers. More than 2,000 miles away in Oregon, police are searching for 39-year-old Christopher Prey. Charged with attempted murder, police say Prey managed to escape from a state psychiatric hospital in Salem Wednesday night, despite being secured in full restraints and leg shackles. The suspect stealing a white Dodge Caravan like this one from a hospital worker and taking police on a high-speed chase, according to authorities. Law enforcement calling Prey extremely dangerous and asking anyone with information to contact them. These are just the latest in a series of high-profile prisoner breakouts this summer. Experts say prison staffing shortages are one factor behind the uptick in escapes. Alexis Christophorus, ABC News, New York.